My name is Gillian Caldwell. I'm the CEO of Global Witness, and I'm originally from New York, but I live in London. My superpower is intuition. I think our rational minds should serve as the very effective administrative assistant to our intuitive capability, and I think intuition's largely undervalued, and that it really enables you to do a lot, both in terms of managing and developing relationships, but also in terms of assessing strategic opportunities and threats. I'm the CEO of Global Witness, and what we do is we focus on natural resource extraction and related environmental human rights abuses and corruption. So we investigate, expose, and advocate around big natural resource extraction projects that are driving hyper inequality and all sorts of environmental challenges and climate change. We're also trying to ensure that earth and land rights defenders who um, stand up against development um, forces, whether they're governments or multinational businesses that are encroaching on their ancestral lands, for example, are safe and secure to articulate their rights and to request and demand consultation in the context of that work. Since I became a Director's Fellow, I worked with the Center for Civic Media to develop a new open source online publishing platform that enables us to publish our investigations and get them to the people who need to know about them all over the world. So that was really exciting and I'm currently scheming other possible collaborations. What's really important is finding time to get out of your everyday office environment and to brainstorm and think creatively about what the big problems are and what solutions we could articulate to address them. I think climate change is the biggest challenge confronting life on Earth today. I think uh, it's too often understood as an environmental problem when in fact it has massive humanitarian and human rights implications, whether it's food security, access to water. I think the repercussions are going to be so significant that it'll be unlike anything we've ever experienced before. So we've got a lot of work on our hands and we need a lot more political will to act than we have today. I wanted to be a lot of different things. I wanted to be a veterinarian. I wanted to be the first woman on the moon. I wanted to be the first woman president. But in the end, I just wanted to be a change maker. And I am.